All right, it's Ashy Knuckles with Rope Dog Radio. Y'all see him, Silver Medalist, Cardo Williams. What's good, bro? Everything good, man. I'm in grind mode right now, getting ready for the 715. Gotta win this USBA with Carson Jones, man. All right, 12 round fight. It's a 10 round fight, 10 round fight. 10 round, fi 10 round fight. How's uh, camp been going so far? Camp How's your been weight? Going excellent, man. I'm actually underweight right now. You know what I mean? So I'm ahead of schedule. You know, this is the time I've been waiting for my whole life. So. I'm gonna get this job done. All right, you're going up against Carson Jones. Pretty good fighter. What are you expecting to see from him on fight night? Um, you know what? Uh, I don't really know too much about him. You know, uh, I checked out a couple videos on YouTube and whatnot. So, if he, uh, <laughs> it's all good. Okay. Yeah, uh, pretty much whatever, whatever he tried to do, man, I'm pretty much ready for it. You know what I mean? If you want to stand there and fight, then fight. If you want to box, we can box. You know what I mean? I'm in 12 round shape for a 10 round bout. So, you know, I'm pretty much ready for anything. All right, you're a southpaw boxer, got a real decent punch. Um, what are some of the things you're working on in camp where you can neutralize all old boy's strength? Yeah, I don't want to let too much out the bat. Yeah. You know, but like I said, I'm pretty much ready for anything, man. We're pretty much working on stepping to this guy when we want to, pretty much boxing when we want to. So, you know, whatever he want to do, we're going to be able to adapt to that. You know, we're fighting in his hometown, and that, you know, that's a statement in itself. That, that. You're riding a 10-fight win streak, mm -hmm. pending the victory on fight night. What are you hoping this victory will do for you going forward? Just open some doors for me, man. Let everybody know that I'm serious. You know, uh, a lot of people feel like I had my chance and I blew it. You know, but God gave me another chance. So I'm just matching my conditioning with my talent now. You know, that's the biggest thing. And I'm taking care of business. All right. Well, the guy that you're fighting, he's probably a little bit taller than you. Probably just got a little bit more reach. But the guy that you guys that you sparring with are taller than him and got way more reach than him. Probably box a little bit better. So, uh, what? How do you think that's going to help you in the fight? And you know, do you, are you worried about his size advantages at all? Nah, I'm not worried at all. Like you said, you know, you seen us in there sparring. You know, I'm sparring with guys six one, six two, who are a whole lot stronger than this guy. You know, and, and then I'm, I'm sparring with guys that are a whole lot faster than this guy. So. Right. Like I said, I'm, I'm pretty much ready, you know what I mean? They, they mixing me in, and I got good work, some of the best work, and I like to thank all those guys, you know who you are. And you know, uh, after the fight, you know, it, it's gonna come out, you know, it's how I'm gonna show. All right, the fight is for the USBA title. Uh, if you win that title, you have a really good chance of being ranked really high in the IBF, if I'm not mistaken. Is that something you got your eye on? When would you like your title shot? You think, you think you need maybe a couple more fights? Man, I, I mean, I ain't rushing, I ain't rushing now. You know, my, I got a pretty good team surrounding me. You know, and they move me like the way I should be moved. So whenever we, whenever they ready, I'm ready. You know what I'm saying? But you know, I'm putting in the work, and that's the most important part. That's my, that's my job. I'm doing my job. That's putting in this work. Okay. We see a lot of guys who get get more than one opportunity, and it's, if you look at their bodies and stuff like that on fight night, they all lethargic and not throwing no punches. Mm -hmm. How do you avoid not being that type of fighter? We got Thanksgiving coming up. You gotta make sure you stay on weight. So I know yeah. you're probably gonna end up being in the gym. So oh yeah, yeah. Thanksgiving, I most definitely be training. You know, like this is a full-time job for me. No doubt. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I'm on weight right now. Actually, I'm underweight, a pound or two. So I'm, I mean, I'm moving good. You know what I mean? If I wanted to take off Thanksgiving and eat as much as I want to, I could. You know what I mean? But that ain't that ain't the route that we're gonna take. We gonna keep it. We gonna stay in grind mode the whole time. Yeah. You know, I'm walking out the gym now. You see what I'm eating now. Yes, you know sir. What I mean? So. I'm feeling pretty good, man, and I'm, I'm ready. All right, what is it about them Cincinnati boys? Y'all got a lot of talent on this fight scene. You got your boy Adrian Broner fighting this weekend in his hometown for a world title. What is it about Cincinnati, man? All that talent coming out that Midwest. Well, it's a fighting city, you know what I mean? And good luck to Adrian Brown. I know you're going to take care of business. Um, but like I said, it's just a fighting city. It's a lot of competition, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And even in the gym, when you spar in Cincinnati, it's like a fight every day. You know no what I mean? Doubt. So that just makes us go to the next level. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that. All right, bro. I ain't gonna keep you. I know you've been working real hard. Mm -hmm. This Ashy Knuckles from Rope Up Radio saying, protect yourself. Protect yourself at all times. Bet that. That's and a wrap. You know, Ricardo Wim checking out, man. And the new. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, you got a Twitter they can follow you on? No, I ain't got no Twitter page yet. Uh, I really don't school. get it too much to that. Yeah, oh, you know. Yeah. Ain't no social I networking just, yeah. for you, huh? I, I just got hip to the Facebook. All uh, right. <laughs> Hey, so, you gotta yeah. have something, you know? No doubt, no hey, doubt. Yeah, hey, fans, y'all out there, connect with him on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Ricardo Williams, Slick Ricky, check him out. No doubt. Peace, Peace bro. Out.